Hello and welcome to Business Update. The Governor of Central Bank of Nigeria, Mr. Godwin Emisele, has announced that a new CBN policy to improve the diaspora remittance into the country takes effect on December 4th. Emisele met this in his remarks on improving remittance inflows into Nigeria obtained from the Apex Bank's official website. He said that policy measures were designed to boost and facilitate an efficient flow of remittances sent home by Nigerians to the diaspora. In an effort to liberalize, simplify, and improve the receipt and administration of the diaspora remittances into Nigeria, CBN wishes to announce as follows Beneficiaries of diaspora remittances through international money transfer operators shall henceforth receive such inflows in foreign currency, which is US dollars, through the designated bank of their choice. Such recipients of remittances may have the option of receiving these funds in foreign currency cash US dollars or into their ordinary domiciliary accounts. These changes are necessary to deepen the foreign exchange market to provide more liquidity and create more transparency in the administration of diaspora remittance into, the, into Nigeria, he said. Emisley said that the changes would help finance a future stream of investment opportunities for Nigerians in the diaspora while also guaranteeing that recipients of remittances would receive a market reflective exchange rate for their inflows. Still on the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN is targeting $2 billion monthly from diaspora remittances. This follows the introduction of the diaspora forex remittance policy by the Apex Bank. CBN Governor Godwin Emisele dropped the hint at a news conference of the new policy in Abuja on Thursday. Citing what obtained in Pakistan as an example, MFL said if Nigeria is able to receive, even if it is just $1 billion monthly or moving close to $2 billion monthly, I'm so certain you all know what will happen to exchange rates in Nigeria if the $2 billion target is met. MFL said he is certain that after some time, deposit money banks will not have any need to begin to call on the CBN to provide dollars to fund their commercial operation so that is why we are saying we want to aggressively take on this and see how this will help our economy. Nigeria's go at home said in the diaspora are being assured that the policy of recipients receiving their money from abroad will kick off today December 4, 2020, blocking any loopholes to manipulate the policy. The Central Bank of Nigeria has ordered all deposit money banks in the country to close all their Naira general ledger through which the Naira remittances were hither to being carried out. The CBN said it took the decision following resistance from international money transfer operators over its new decision on diaspora remittances. The implementation of the African Continental Free Trade Area Agreement will make the African Continental Market the largest free trade area. A CGE model analyst result shows a growth volume of trade accounting for 73% of gains in real consumption. Nigeria's real GDP per worker rises by 1.43% as a result of trade liberalization. ACFTA changes share of expenditure on goods across countries. Imports from China, Ni imports from China Nigeria's top trade partner, declined by 11.3%. And that's it on business updates. I am Nenu Mazaka. Do have a good evening.